Ukraine managed to advance only 17 kilometers for five months of counter-offensive General Zaluzny. Valery Zaluzny, the commander-in-chief of Ukraine's armed forces, believes that the situation at the front has reached a stalemate when neither side can advance because they are technologically equipped at the same level. The general says the situation reminds him of the First World War events. He announced this to The Economist publication. Ukraine has managed to advance only 17 kilometers for five months of counter-offensive. Russia fought for 10 months around Bakhmut in the east to take a town six by six kilometers. Sharing his first comprehensive assessment of the campaign, Zaluzny said the battlefield reminded him of a major conflict that happened a century ago. Just like in the First World War, we have reached the level of technology that puts us into a stalemate. There will most likely be no deep and beautiful breakthrough. Zaluzny said, the general believes that a powerful technological leap is needed to break the stalemate. The counter-offensive's course undermined Western expectations that Ukraine could use it to prove the war's unwinnable nature and thus change Vladimir Putin's calculus, forcing the Russian president to the negotiating table. It also undermined General Zaluzny's assumption that he could stop Russia by bleeding its troops. This was a mistake. Russia has lost at least 150,000 dead. In any other country, such casualties would have stopped the war, Zaluzny noted. But that doesn't concern Russia. As life there is cheap and Putin focuses on the First and Second World Wars in which Russia lost tens of millions of people. The army of the Ukrainian standard should advance with a speed of 30 kilometers per day, breaking through the Russian defense lines.